cold drinks, that's the motherfucking recipe. Cześć, witajcie, z tej strony Max, witam was w piątym odcinku z The Book of Unwritten Tales. Dzisiaj będziemy zdawać test na maga, spróbujemy zdać cały w tym odcinku, pogadamy sobie jeszcze z mistrzem Markusem. Czy masz co przeciwko arcymagowi? It's just that we've known each other for aeons. You could say all our lives, really. And he... he gets on my nerves. <laughs> Why? His raised index finger. His idealism, his... He always just sees the good in everything. What's wrong with believing in good? <laughs> Nothing. I used to as well. But when you look at what's happened to this town, what's happening to so many other towns, then you really have to be an idiot not to doubt everything. I see no reason to. Then you're just a happy gnome. Może masz jakąś niepotrzebną starą szatę maga dla mnie? Perhaps have an old robe I could wear. Certainly not. Not in your size anyway, little man. Anyway, it's tradition for the prospective mage to tailor their first robe themselves. Can you sew? I was always good at handicrafts. That's good. You can't imagine how ridiculous lots of these mages look with their self-tailored robes. Or oh, without them, when a gust of wind blows. Mage robes have to be made out of a special magical fabric. It protects you from many simple spells and curses. But for that, it has to be sewn using a magical needle as well. Hmm, so I need a magically treated cloth and a needle and thread. That much is clear. Mm -hmm. And I need a pattern. I mean, it's not like I know a lot about magic robes. <laughs> Masz mi przypomnę, kto mógłby mi sprawdzić magiczną Can I buy a magic wand here in the school? Or is there somewhere else I can find one? You can't just buy any old wand. The wand has to fit the mage, you understand? The wand picks the mage, not the other way around. Tutaj w karym potarze. Ale the merchant if he's got a couple of wands. Lots of good mages have died recently. Perhaps you'll get lucky. Get lucky. Skąd mam wziąć starte złota? Where am I supposed to get a pile of gold? If I knew where there were piles of gold just lying around, then I would have helped myself by now, don't you think? Can't I just work off once you've accepted the system? Ah, a gnome can't earn that much with honest work. You don't expect me to steal, do you? There are many gradations between honest work and stealing. Take Whooperman, the showman. No worries. He's very rich, and that without ever having worked, and without ever stealing. How does that work? He knows people's folly and makes use of it. Ask him. My do niego pójdziemy. His wagon is out there on the meadow. No. Here, take this. Mapa nam da. No. A postcard. Kosztówka. Tam tu były te znaki, to jedno było na łąkę, a drugie na bagna. Tam pójdziemy na łąkę, on tam jest i tam będzie trzeba trochę myśleć, że muszę sobie zaraz papier, karteczkę sobie wziąć. Jakiś długopis sobie wezmę, będzie mi potrzebny. To my już sobie pójdziemy. I tu popatrzył na rzecz, na tablicę. Maybe it's been written on using magic chalk. It's blank. But it could have been written on using magic chalk. <laughs> it's a stylish... It is alive. Really? Yes. And covered in magical chalk. I knew it! <laughs> Oh, I'd give a lot to be able to read these books, but I'm sure only students are allowed to do that. Oh, I. To będzie my też robić w tym kotle. There's a lot of weird ingredients that could be used for the pot. Could I maybe just once? No. But I. No. Just for pupils. Ah, pupils. Wiem co. Bo na uczelni podańskiej mówi pupils, what? What is that? A mirror? I can only see myself in it faintly. The frame is quite heavy and decorated with all sorts of faces and skulls. And the mirror surface, it flows. I've never seen anything like it. That's what I am. 
A lovely crystal ball on a small stand. Hmm, it looks completely transparent to me. No fog, no burning eyes, and no visions of the future to be found. <laughs> that was fun. Um, Master Marcus, can you predict the future with the ball? You what? That's just silly hocus pocus. You need tea leaves or tarot cards for that. Then why do you have the ball? <laughs> it was a promotional gift. May I have it? If you like. Thank you. Sidasha. A shorn sheep, I think. Golana. <laughs> sheep are more dangerous than they would have us believe. They're hiding something. That's what Grandad says. Ci mogę w nim tylko hają trawce. Most are quite dusty. Um, Master Marcus, what are all these things in this box? Hmm? Oh, that's just old magic stuff. Help yourself. Great, thanks. Here's a needle and some. No, i głazniczko. And here are three small glass vials filled with colored potions, all tightly corked. Hmm. Um. The rest really does seem to be just junk. An old cloth teddy bear, a torn leather bag, a little soap, nothing that interests me. Mm. Beneath the head there hangs a sign. It reads, The sheep, a mage's best friend. Mm. It protects us, it keeps us warm. Wow. Wow. Sheep are a little like cows, small woolly cows. <laughs> I wonder how many humans once trained to become mages here. Three. Do, do. Haha. Dobra, wyjdziemy. Oj, oj! You! You! O, to ten szczur. What's going on over there? Zorro. Mały Zorro. Boom, motherfucker! Wow! A super villain! I'll get you if it's the last thing I do. It'll be your turn sooner or later. <laughs> to było ten szur, którego mamy złapać. Hello, Mr. Merchant. Ah, you. What? I'm working on it. Well, good. Chciałbym coś kupić. Chciałbym kupić magiczną różkę. I need a magic wand. Do you have any in stock? Of course, I have the largest range of magic wands you'll find anywhere. Excellent. But you know, magic wands have to match the mage, so they have to come down to test the wand personally. I am the mage. Soon? You? <laughs> That's a good one. That's a good one. I mean it. I don't have any time for kids messing about. Gnomento. But I need a magic wand to be accepted into the mage school. Please, let me try it. Ah, uh, well, if you must. Come here. Yeah. Wave it around in the air a bit. Nothing. <whistles> Try this one. It's five and a quarter inch balsa, threaded with a lugworm spinal cord. Mm, this is going to take some time. I've had enough. That's it. There's not one single spark of magic in you, and I'm not having you waste any more of my time. But that was only four magic ones. Aha. Uh -huh. I don't care of that enough. I haven't got any more. Anyway. Tough. Go and find a one somewhere else. Sure, Thanks for much. all your help. Hmm. Thanks for nothing. Go fuck yourself. It's there inside me. I know it. I just have to find the right one. Okay. Hello, Mr. Ah, you. Well, mm-hmm. I want to get a copy. Uh, I want to get a bell of magic night. Oh, magic night, can I go material? I've got that here. That's two gold per five. Ile mierzył to? How much is that? Uh, a good two dwarfs feet, or one and a half minotaur inches, three eighths gnome, if you like. <laughs> I see. And how many thighs to the roll? About the one and a quarter sea stone rods. That's about two and a half fathoms, right? That should do it. That seems pretty expensive to me. The prices have just gone up. 
You just can't imagine how much demand there is for magically worked cloth when there's a war on. It's a hell of a business. Pewnie. Dobra. Nie chcę nic kupować. I już sobie idę. Somewhere down there in the sewers, the King of Thieves has his realm. But I'm much too large to fit down there. Somewhere down there, but I'm much. Dobra, my pójdziemy sobie sprawdzić łąkę. Wuppermann. Wow, the wagon is like a house on wheels. Probably wasn't cheap. Pardon. I definitely wouldn't want to get into a punch-up with the pony that pulls this wagon. Yeah, I'm so lucky. Wow, how did this? A cage full of hair. Huh? Here's a small sign saying Bertram, the world's fattest hamster. Wow! I don't know if Bertram really is the fattest hamster in the world, but I reckon he's right up there. That's convenient. What the? An empty cage, I guess. The sign says, "Ziggy, the invisible pink squirrel, may bite. Please stay back." Ziggy's doing well, I think. Ale skąd on wyszedł z rozrawa? The cage is lined with straw. There are lots of pigeon feathers and, uh, well, the other stuff the pigeons leave lying around. I'll just take one feather, a big clean one. Big clean one. Cooler. A crystal ball. I wonder if the showman really can predict the future with it. Showman. Hello. Excuse me. Oh, hello. A young gnome, and he's got outstanding manners to boot. What brings you here? My name's Wilbur Weathervin. I'm from the White Ridge Mountains, and I have to speak to the Archmage. Well then, young Wilbur, I'm Willie the Wondrous. What can I do for you? Check my dick, bitch. Is this showman, and brother? Master Marcus told me. I don't know which showman your master Marcus told you about, but I am a showman. Willie Wupperman's the name. Some people call me Willie the Wondrous, but I only run my little fun fair on the side. First and foremost, I'm a fortune teller. Mister Marcus said that he is very rich. Are you sure that you're very rich? Why do you ask? Do you want to rob me? Yes. Oh no. Dokładnie, dawaj złoto. Skoro jesteś osnowiedzą, czy nie powinien, czy nie powinieneś tego widzieć? As a fortune teller, you you'd have to know if I wanted to rob you, wouldn't you? I like you. Of course, I would know. I think. No, you don't want to rob me. What do you want then? I think ciao. A lot of gold to be accepted into the mage school. A pile of gold. Uh -huh. hmm. I do have that much gold here, but it's the top prize from the Wheel of Fortune. I can't just give it to you. James, come back. That would be too easy. Hmm. I probably have to ask for the right resource. Can you really predict the future? Of course. People come from all across the land to ask me for advice, and I give them good tips in exchange. For good gold. And what do they want to know? They want to know, for example, if the price of bread is going to rise. Mm -hmm. Then I tell them, yes, the price will rise. Then everyone buys lots of bread as a precaution, and the price really does rise. Magic. Or the women want to know what next season's color will be. I always know. So if you say that the ladies will be wearing green next year, then everyone wears green. You must be an excellent fortune teller, then. The best. Would people pay me so much gold for my prophecies if I wasn't? 
A dać się muszę iść w ten trójkąt tej gwiezdy. Odchodzi się klatkami. Oh, the animals used to be part of my fair, but since I started earning my money with fortune telling, they're just a hobby. Apart from the pigeons, of course. What's with the pigeons? The pigeons deliver my prophecies throughout the land. I work mainly for people I don't know personally. Mm. Why? Well, how shall I put it? Should a prophecy not quite come to pass, then it's better to be far away. <laughs> Bertman is but for you to be pronounced. Uh, excuse me, but your hamster, Bertram, isn't he a little overweight? Of course. He's the fattest hamster in the world. But isn't the cage just a touch too small? No, what? No, Bertram likes it cozy and he doesn't move around all that much. <laughs> Imagine that. Uh, it's very very can you do being as good near the hammer? Only invisible is also pretty quiet, isn't it? Hmm, perhaps it's sleeping. Yes, perhaps. <laughs> you're um, you're absolutely certain there's a squirrel in there. Let's get a check. Of course, it's the only invisible pink squirrel in captivity. They're very rare. With with pleasure. Oh no. How does it work? As you can see, there are four different colors. Rasta. Red, yellow, green and blue. blue. You tell me which color the wheel is going to stop on. If you manage to get it right three times in a row, then you win the jackpot. Isn't it rather unlikely that someone would be able to guess the right color three times in a row? If it was easy, then the top prize wouldn't be a sack of gold. But I would okay. Okay. Which color do you Turn stop on red? All right then. Off we go. Po pierwsze tylko tak ona prób. Oh. Do you want to try it? No, dobra. Just one. Be my guest. Which color? It'll stop on blue. All. As you, you are with. The showman could do much more with his own ball than he could with. Okay, O, też ma samą przylepną. Pewnie można ją wziąć. Hmm, a roll of transparent tape. With sticky. Wow. Maszyna RPG. The machine is dead. It seems nothing works when the server is out. Come on, Pim. No demon, no danger. A vial filled with the red potion. A blue potion in a little vial. No idea what it does. I'm supposed to drink a potion whose effects I can only... On the other hand, hey. What the fuck? Mm, nothing. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> the boss of a list. A green potion. Maybe the second potion will do something. Again, nothing. Oh, 
Oh, wait. Everything's spinning. Was that alcohol, maybe? What the fuck? I not. I'm not allowed to drink alcohol yet. <laughs> God, lol. Oh, back to normal. I'm only going to take a sip, though. Just in case it's alcohol again. Hey, everything's getting bigger. Finally, a useful portion. Hmm. Somewhere down there in the... But I'm much too... Okay. I'm almost small enough to get into the sewer, but I'm all. Hey, yo. Hello, Mr. Merchant. Ah, you. Well. Hi. Okay, to my chance. Już do was wracam, bo brat do mnie wbiegł do pokoju, żebym szedł na obiad, ale powiedziałem, że zaraz są w połowie odcinka, to już skończę go. Nie mogę dosyć do kanału, to są za duże. <laughs> I bet you haven't been able to say that too many times, eh? I've got something for you. Oh, kill him. It's a shrinking ring. It, that might help. What do you mean, thanks? Pay me first. Bez tego pieśni nie udało mi się upolować króla złodziei! You know what? Just keep the ring. I can look for another way to get into... I'm sure something will come to me over the next couple of days or weeks. You won't have any problems dealing with the King of Thieves until then, will you? Mm, right. <laughs> I have to go. Maybe I'll... If you have... <laughs> the potion could help get me into the sewer. I should drink it near the end. Okay. Let's see if it works. Oh, that's disgusting. Mmm, <laughs> but it shrank. Kimalotki. Yeah. Needs must. Oh. Okay. Hopefully I won't grow. Gemma. Oof, that smell is not exactly inspiring. I wonder where that... That's far and no far. Who are you and what do you want? I call myself the Artangante. It's the best thing in the world. Uh, en garde! Walk on the match, very good. Very good. I'm asking if you will be able to... My name is Wilbur Weatherbein. I'm a powerful mage. Almost. Raden Wilbur, how? We jumped on the crystal. I watched you escape from the merchant. Very impressive. Thank you, but I think the merchant sees it differently. I thought you looked like a real hero, although, although you're nothing but a thief. That is undeniable. I've robbed the merchant many times, and I do it again. I'm on a mission from the merchant. Oh, yes. What's the old skin flint going to give you for that? <laughs> well, I can choose three things from a... That means you're hunting me for your own personal profit. You're a bounty hunter, will be weather then. No, 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 no. I'm on an important mission. And I need the merchant's help to accomplish it. You should choose your friends more wisely, Wilbur. I'm certainly not going to let myself get caught just so your merchant can have his revenge. But I have to bring the merchant your mask, otherwise he won't help me. And then I won't get accepted into the mage school. Which means I'll never be a powerful mage. Which means I won't be able to see the archmage. Which means I won't be able to give him the ring, which means I'll have failed. Quite complicated, no? <laughs> you should see my quest log. In any case, I'm supposed to take you out and then give the merchant your mask. Do you want... Do you want to kill me? No. No. Could you kill me? No. That's another no. Then you should come up with another plan. Oh, Why do you do it? Why do you steal? Perhaps I'm just greedy. Have a look around. I love the luxury. Uh, don't... If I were to say to you that I have to look after my family and friends, huh? 
that there's not enough food left for us rats since the inhabitants. Could that change anything? No. I will still be a thief. But a likable one. Hmm. Can't you find some other way to get food? How? Cultivate cereals down here and then bake bread? We're hmm. rats. We haven't got sensible towns. You could leave the city. There's more than enough to eat growing in the fields and woods. I would go, but how should I get the others out there? Some of them are so weak they are walking on all fours. I can't leave anyone behind. This is the one that loves the season, yeah? But if I were to get you enough food so that all of you could eat your fill, would you then be able to leave the city? Sure, but where are you going to find all that food? Is it theft if you take some bread for a family of starving rats? Yes, but we would never forget it. Us rats can help you, you know. You could be of help. If you want to be a mage, you've still got lots of work ahead of you. And you'll be surprised what you can find down here in the We can get you lots of things you won't find anywhere else. Would you do that? Of course. That's the deal. You get us something to eat and make it a generous portion. And in return, we'll help you become a mage. But I still need your mask. Okay. If you insist, then I'll give you my mask too. But first, you must bring us the promised food. No problem. I hope. I need to get... If you want to... I wiem jak to zabędziemy. The sandwich would be just right for the rats, but I can't just take it from. Hello, Mr. Shieldhand. Hello, Wilbur. What do you want? According to Master Marcus, I really do have the potential to become a mage. Marcus is teaching again. Yes, and he wants me to be his pupil. I can imagine that. And what does he want? I just have to bring him a magic wand and a mage's robe. And what else? Well, that and a pile of gold. There you go. He just wants to rip you off, believe me. You can't become a mage. Don't throw your money. You'll see. Mm. Um, Mr. Shieldhand, could you maybe... Of his group a Roya, but are traveling. Nope. Are you sure? Why should I? It's going to be a long day, and I'll still need something to snack on for my next break. If we compete for the sandwich in a thrilling game, mano y nomo. Um, you give me a number between one and a hundred, and if you're wrong, I get the sandwich. And what do I get if I'm spot on? Two sandwiches or three? No. I'm not all that hungry, and to be honest, I find your game pretty stupid too. Then you suggest a better one. Well, there's only one thing. A duel to the death. Um, it's just a sandwich. A deck of cards? Of course. What are you thinking of then? <laughs> and if I win, I get the sandwich? Sure, why not? I have never lost. I'm Seastone's all-time unbeaten champion in every class. Jakie są zasady gry? How does this game work? Don't you know Master of Dragon Slayer's Defender? The oh, fuck? Really? Well, okay. I'll show you. We've both got a stack of cards. Choose ten from your pile. That's your deck. You should see that you've got three red, four yellow, and two green. But you've also got a specialism in pole arm weapons and. But only if your magic is light based, with fire magic or earth magic. And those are the rules, more or less. Get it? All right. But it seems like you don't stand a chance of winning unless you have very good cards. That's not a problem. I've got very good ones. So, are we going to play? Okay, then let's play a round. But I know. Oh, of course, I can't give you the impossibly good cards. They're too valuable. I'm afraid you're going to have to put up with the not such good cards. All right. Oh. <laughs> yeah, boom! Motherfucker. I'm the unbeaten champion! Yes! Yes! I could beat him. It's just my cards. I don't have a chance. I'm gonna get... Oh. Okay. <laughs>
Yo, 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 yo. Mr. King? How can I help you? I was on the chat to this and I'm not in the world. It's a huge sandwich. And if I beat him at a game of cards, it's mine. The town guard has always got lots of delicious food with him. But he'd never risk losing any of it. He must be pretty sure that he's not going to lose his game. At the moment, I'm afraid that's a very real possibility. Hmm, what kind of different game cards? All with a picture and some text. The backs are blue with brown lines. Hmm, I've seen something like that before. Very well. Who lives down here besides yourself? Oh, lots of interesting people. My family and all the other remaining rat fam. Uncle Juan joined us recently. He used to have a good life in a dwarf bastion, but then a wild robot savagely attacked him. He fought for his life. Bravely. To jest ten szur, którego my tym robotem, jak to się nazywa, wygoniliśmy stamtąd. All the stuff that young adventurers expect to find in a sewer. Do a lot of people come down here? Not so much recently. In the past, when the town was more lively, there was always adventurers coming here on the strangest of missions. It was almost as if there was someone standing up there, sending the newbies down the sewer in droves. Crazy. Hmm. I need to kill one to do. Yep. What was it, this? I'm not getting any closer than three steps away from that. We gnomes live below Earth ourselves, but this isn't doing anything for me. The other rats will be back there somewhere, lonely and hungry. That's disgusting sewer slime, and to top it off, it's mouldy too. How else? So. <laughs> 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 On I should not touch the pole. Marcus? Yes. I went to the merchant and tried all his magic wands. None of them worked for me. Mm, there could be two reasons for that. Either he didn't have the right wand, there's even less magic in you than I thought. Perhaps you didn't want it enough. As you know, you've really got to believe. And I can't train you without a wand. I'll find a wand. Yes, of course you will. Masz przypadkiem, znasz grę o nazwie Master of Dragon Slayer's Defender? Nie wiem o card games. Have you played Master of Dragon Slayer's Defender? Hmm, yes, I played it for a while before Wob came out, <laughs> but I always lost a sh back then. He was still old Pew's assistant. He always went on and on about how great he was. No wonder with those cards. I'm playing against him at the moment and I don't have a ghost of a chance. Hmm, I wouldn't mind seeing young Bartholomew not from his here. These are the best cards I've got. Thanks. I'll put them in my deck. Then I can use them and give him all you. I'll go if you. Psst. Wilbur. Psst. Down here. Huh? I'm going to get some other lemmings. Hello. What's up? I've got something for you. A game card. I knew I'd seen something like that before. It was swimming around in the sewer. But he stay dry. He's got a protective coating, you see? It seems to be part of a special card. Auntie Juanita said that the owner threw himself from a tower after he accidentally dropped it down the drain. Wow. <laughs> Thanks. I hope it helps you. Good luck. Think. Klopa <laughs> I'll use the magic tape to stick both halves of the... It works. I co gramy? To rzeczowniku? Motherfucker. Hello Mr. Shieldhand. Hello Wilbur. Wygrałeś kiedy tak już lepsz kart. Oh, no. Your cards are so much better than mine. Why don't you let me some better ones? What so it would be more difficult for me? Why would I If you don't want to ensure a fair game, then I'll do it. I'm going to get some better cards. Good luck then. I actually did find a card. Take a look at this. <gasps> Is this a special card? I'm only asking because of the nubs and such. It's, uh... It's almost a... Uh, no, unfortunately. Absolutely no damaged or repaired cards can be used in play. But... I know the rules exactly and I can make no exceptions. And you're certain you didn't just make that up? Uh, 
I'm off to get my maid. Ja wiem jak to zrobimy. Idziemy do mistrza Markosa, on ma tam chyba zasady tej gry. Has the market? Yes. Mr. Shieldhand says I'm not allowed to use a card that's been repaired. Oh, he does, does he? I beg to. Mm. What's that? The official rules. And it says here, one may use a card in any condition as long as at least 51% of the card is intact and the text can be read. Which means? The card is absolutely fine. And that little weasel risks being thrown out of the player's union if he doesn't accept your challenge. Mm. Take the rule book, stick it in his pipe and make him squid the greatest of pleasure. I'll go and get if you say so. No. Thank you about. Hello, Mr. Shieldhand. The rules say something very different about broken cars to what you did, Master Shieldhand. But oh yes, it is. I hereby challenge you, and I will use the card. But well, that won't help you anyway. I am the champion. <laughs> that... That's impossible. That was a win, I'd say. But I'm the unbeaten champion. The once beaten champion? May I have the sandwich now? That's not fair. You cheated. I want to... <laughs> But what prize would you offer if I won again? Could I go up the t No, that can't be done. Something else. Hmm. I don't have one of those. World peace? Not in my... Then I think I'll just take the... We agreed that I get your... But I'm not going to give it to you. I won. Fair and square. And that's exactly what I'm going to tell everyone too. Oh, that's not possible. I'm the champion. Me! Nobody can beat me. Hmm. How about this? You give me the sandwich, and I'll just forget about ever having beaten you. And I want my cards back. All the cards. Yours too. We've never played. And I get the sandwich? That's it. And this won't ever be mentioned again. All right. Look at my And I left a card this time. Yeah. My card. That should be a feast for the rats. Chow down. Okay. Needs must. Oh. Wilbur, did you bring that thing here? I sure did. It almost crushed Tiny Tim. <laughs> oh, uh, sorry, but Hey, that's fantastic. With this sandwich, we can all eat our fill and finally leave this hole. Happy to hear it. But we're not going until you get your mage degree. We're going to help. Just ask me if there's anything we should look for in the sewer for you. Oh, thanks. I'll do And here's one of my spare masks. I won't let the Martians see me again. You can claim you defeated me. So, good luck. Thanks. Sorry, sorry. Mr. King? How can I? Someone be glad to see something in the sewers for me. Nigga. Sure. What do you? But should we make sure? You happen to have a magic wand, would you? Maybe we do. Many mages have come into the sewers over the years. Some of them never left. Could you have a look for a wand? Sure. If we find something, we'll hang a white flag in front of the entrance to the sewers and place the wand there. Great. Hmm. Start How about gold, a whole pile of it. Anything like that down you? Aye. We won't be able... There are many treasures down here. Gold, silver, gemstones, precious weapons, but... The giant spiders have taken it all. And you don't want to mess with the giant spiders. <laughs> I have to sew myself a mage's robe. Could you see if I can find a pattern? Hmm. A pattern to make a mage's robe. In no... But there used to be a large tailor's workshop in the east of the town. It is possible that young mage novices also got their robes there. That would be nice of you. Maybe there's still something there. And now for something completely different. 
Take care, Mr. King. Take care, my friend. Pat! You such a stupid bitch! Look what I have here! The King of Thieves mask! Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. That's what I've said all along. If you want something done, then you have to do it yourself. Um. Yes, yes, a deal's a deal. Two, we agree. I uh, don't think so. I still remember exactly. <laughs> you bring me the King of Thieves mask, and I'll let you choose two. Ale ja wiem, że o trzech mówisz, Fraser. But nothing from my death. But no arguments. You've earned it, my boy. Hello, Mr. Ah. I want to collect. I would like a roll of magically treated cloth as a reward for my epic battle against the what King of Thieves. Pop, 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 pop. Hmm. Well, do you think someone just gave me that mask as a present? I earned that roll. <laughs> <laughs> the standard okay. represents Charlie. I'll come back. Take your time. I have to go. If you have. I need more time to finish it, bro. O, jeszcze troszeczkę znaleźli. The white flag, the king of thieves. Let's see. Ooh, there's a piece of paper in there. The good old king of thieves. This is a pattern for a human child's mage robe. Let's kill this guy. Well. Hmm. Let's see. There's something there. No, she's coming. That by itself doesn't help me. It works. It works. This is my one. No magic in you. Here we go. Hmm. Da, na pewno tak zrób. Tada! And Grandad always said handicrafts were only for girls. Bitch. Now let's go. Skończymy już to odcinek tak długi. Zrobimy więcej już w kolejnym odcinku. W kolejnym odcinku zostaniemy już magiem. Więc to było na tyle w tym odcinku. Myślę, że Wam się spodobał. Zapraszam Was do innych serii. Mówił dla Was Max i cześć!